Hello, this is Chizzy941 here, and I'm going to show you how to make a Croot hut. This could be used as an objective marker or something, as well as uh, just a piece of scenery. Now, what you will need is PVA glue, Games Workshop plastic glue, string, a few cocktail sticks, cardboard. A random assortment of uh, spare pieces you got for whichever army you're doing this for. And toilet roll. I know it seems weird, but you do. Watered down PVA. And, of course, scissors. Now, as you can see here, what I've done is I've cut out a base from the cardboard. And I've used the cocktail sticks to make a teepee like shape. Now the reason I didn't show you this is because I have no idea how to edit my stuff, so it'll take forever. Anyway, what you do now is you separate the two sides of the toilet roll, or if it's thin just use that, and you dip it inside the watered down PVA. It doesn't matter too much with rips at this stage because it gives it a sort of rustic look, and you're going to do more than one layer anyway. Now all you do is you just go round the entire thing. You can always drift a bit more on if you don't think it's wet enough. But make sure you obviously you're gonna do more than one layer of this, but make sure that you do cover as much as you can with as little as this. With the smallest amount. Also, leave the top part covered. I know I didn't do it here, but try and do that. That gives it a sort of you know how the if there's a fire in the middle or something, it's going to need smoke coming out for the gas themselves. So you just continue doing this until you are satisfied that you've got a thick enough layer. I'm sorry this tutorial video is going to be a bit boring, but I just wanted to make sure that you get everything in. And like I've said before, Sod knows how to edit. A camera video but anyway so you just keep doing this until you're satisfied with the uh, layers of stuff they have I hope you also look better than this I'm just doing this because well my original one was good anyway anyway so all you do is you just keep going around that because I'm kind of rushing here it doesn't really matter if it gets wet because, unlike me, you are going to leave it to dry. Now, you can just stick on some pieces of whichever um, army you're doing it for. I've picked Croot. So, I'm doing it for my Croot. Come on, glue, get out. And you just stick these on wherever you want it to go eventually after you're satisfied with the amount of detail and the amount of um, stuff that's on leave it to dry and I'd say at least overnight because painting on a wet surface is never good especially if it's the wet thing that you're painting after this all you need to do is spray it black I didn't say that of course but anyway and then after the black has dried, you will just use your paints to paint the toilet paper. And if you see, I think this looks quite a bit like uh, animal skin to myself, but I don't know if you do, but I think it does anyway. And then you can always add details such as string. I know I didn't show this, but it'd be too much of a faff around. And then um, you can always put sand on the bottom as well. And there you have it, a croot hut. I hope you do better than mine, but there you go.